Dracula, home for many centuries to a dreadful dynasty of vicious vampire ducks, the Counts of Dracula. Legend has it that these foul beings can be destroyed by a stake through the heart or exposure to sunlight. This does not suffice, however, for they may be brought back to life by means of a secret rite that can be performed once a century when the moon is in the eighth Bad house of Aquarius. Blood. Are you getting it? The latest reincarnation did not run according to plan. Ooh. In the heart of Transylvania. <laughs> High amidst the Transylvanian Alps stands the fearful and forbidding fortress that is known as Castle Dracula, a castle that few have visited and from whence even fewer have returned. And yet, even now, some poor, innocent, unsuspecting soul is trying to gain entry to this domain of darkness and despair. Shall I order a new front door, my lord? No need for that, Igor. We haven't replaced the last one yet. I regret to say that I took the liberty of replacing it only yesterday, sir. Ah. Order a new front door, would you, Igor? At once, my lord. It's the men cycles. Er, the cyclopedia. The cyclopedia cycle book sales? Oh, the encyclopedia salesman again. Oh, why didn't you say so? Don't they ever give up? Perhaps, my lord, if I were to explain to them that if their departure is not undertaken in the immediate future, they will find themselves somewhat deficient in the leg department. Good thinking, Igor. That should do it. Hop to it. Oh, I fear it is they who will be doing the hopping, my lord. That's good, Igor. That's funny. I'll remember that one. Boy, are those guys ever persistent. That must be the third time this week. I mean, what do I want with an encyclopedia, anyway? Have they gone, Igor? <clears throat> yes, my lord. They have left. <laughs> Never to darken our door again, huh? I would imagine, my lord, that they will not be returning. I hope you weren't too hard on them, Igor. <clears throat> Good. That's that. That is that, Igor. Oh, indeed, sir. And what is more, you are now the proud owner of a complete 24-volume set of the Encyclopedia Transylvania, sir. Oh, good. I... What? You mean... You mean you... You... They... they were very persuasive, my lord. Igor, you bought the encyclopedia? Precisely, my lord. Igor, you're an... Oh. Come on, then. Let me see it. Boy, oh, boy, that's incredible. <gasps> that's amazing. Oh, that's impossible. Well, that's stupid. And that's... Uh, that's unpronounceable. Wow. Lost Temple. Treasure? Nanny, Igor, we're gonna be rich, rich, rich! You shouted, sir? Yes, Igor. You know what this is? A book. Part of the encyclopedia, my lord. Exactly. Volume 20. Set to work. Now listen to this. Treasure. Umbaciles. Lost Tribe of the... Lost Tribe of the... Lost tribe of the what? The Umbaciles. Well, why doesn't it say so? It does, Nanny. They just put the words in a different order. Why? Why? <laughs> well, it's it's because... <clears throat> Umbaciles, lost tribe of the... The Temple of Barney and its horde of untold riches has lain undiscovered in the jungle of the Umbaciles. Wow, the lost temple of Barmy, untold riches. You know what we're going to do? We're going to fly the castle to darkest Africa, find the lost temple, and bring back those untold riches right back here. Ah, uh, another sausage, Commodore. Uh, 
Just shivel of you, Medra. Nothing like a spot of brekka before you go out exploring for lost temples, eh? Uh, nothing like it. <laughs> nothing like it. Good grief. Tell me about her, Medra. Well, awkward moment to have to tell you this, Commodore. But, um... I fear I may have a touch of the jungle fever. Jungle fever? Oh, I say, that's rather bore show. What? It is rather. Um, seem to be hallucinating. Hallucinating, you say? Yeah, ho oh, oh. first sign of jungle fever hallucinations. Yeah, that's what they say. <laughs> what are these hallucinations? Are pink elephants, little green men, big blue buffalo with orange wigs and aquilungs? What? Yeah, yeah. Ah. Uh... Looks like a Transylvanian castle. Good Lord, where? Over there. <gasps> Great Scott! Dash convincing hallucination of what? My word, my word, yes, uh, dash convincing. Mm. Tricky, tricky chap, jungle fever. Oh, 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 oh tricky, tricky. <laughs> now then, um, if you're in agreement, Commodore, I suggest we finish our breakfast. Um, have another sort of fine lost temple before lunch. Good show. Oh, good show. All right, all right, you two. There's not a moment to lose. They're looking for the Lost Temple, too. We've got to get there before they do. Lost Temple, indeed. Oh, come on, Igor. We're going to need maps, a compass, machetes to hack our way through the dense and unyielding jungle foliage. Dense and unyielding jungle foliage, my lord. Uh-huh. That's what it says in the encyclopedia, Igor. Oh, I see, sir. Amazing! Did you know that the elephant is the only creature in the animal kingdom to have four knees, Igor? No, sir, I did not. Well, that's what it says here. Volume 6. Easy to explain. Quite incredible, my lord. Well, you can explain it to me, then. Hmm? What? If it's so easy to explain, Mr. Cleverboots, you can explain it to me. Explain what? I don't know, do I? What you said! If I may be permitted to explain, sir. Yeah, please do, Igor. It's quite easy, Nanny. It's his book. Easy to explain, volume six. That's what you keep saying, but I still don't understand. Oh. Nanny, look. Easy to explain. <laughs> well, it might be. But it still doesn't say what. What? What's what? What's easy to explain? Nanny, I... Um... Wow, wowie, wow! Another revelation, my lord. It says here that if a baby put on weight at the same rate as a caterpillar, at the end of two weeks it would weigh eight tons. The baby or the caterpillar, my lord? The baby, of course, Igor. Igor, I don't think you're taking this seriously. Oh. Sir, whatever makes you say that. Incredible. You see these plants, Eeyore? You mean these green things that persist in scratching me in the face, getting in the way, tickling my ears, and generally irritating me to death, my lord? Mm hmm. Those are the ones, Eeyore. It says here that they can grow up to ten feet in a day. Mm. Most edifying, my lord. Ten feet in a day? Huh. I wouldn't like to get his shoe bill. <laughs> his shoe bill. <laughs> Ten... <clears throat> but seriously, that's some growth rate, huh? Oh, Savers! What was that? It couldn't be, could it? Be what? It sounded to me, sir, like a werewolf. Maybe Darkest Africa will turn out to have its good points after all. <laughs> yes, most definitely a werewolf. Oh, can we keep him? It'll be nice company for Towser. Towser? Our werewolf. Igor, do we have a werewolf? Oh, no, my lord. Then why would we want to waste time chasing after werewolves to keep a werewolf that we don't have? Uh, oh, I say, I'm most frightfully sorry that I startle you. Oh, don't look a bit like a werewolf, are you? He's all big and hunky. Yes, well, I, I try to keep in shape. See that, triceps? Years of training there. And I have to admit, I am rather oh. proud of my pet. Oh! As for my gluteus maximum. Yes, but, uh, Mr... Oh! 
Where are my manners? I don't know. I haven't seen them. Anybody seen his manners? Where are they? I haven't introduced myself yet. Oh. Uh, me, Tarzan. Oh, me, Nanny. <laughs> are you going to carry me off, then? You have to be joking. Oh. How do you do, Mr. Tarzan? I am Count Ducula, intrepid explorer, and these are my bearers, Igor and Nanny. Delighted. We are searching for the lost temple of Bami. Oh, really? Now, there's a coincidence. Pater led an expedition to find that years ago. Oh, Pater? <laughs> yes. When I was a little chap, he and some chums came over here to find the lost temple. We got shipwrecked, and I never saw him again. I was raised by some awfully nice apes here in the jungle. Rather jolly, really. Oh, you live in the jungle, huh? That's right, yes. So you know where the lost temple is? Oh, yes. Not too far from here, actually. Just sort of keep on in that direction for a few miles. Turn left at the waterfall. Left again at the giant baobab tree. Straight on until you come to the cliff face. First right, right again, and there you are. You can't miss it. After the treasure, are you? Yes. Uh, 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 that is, uh, no, no, purely a sightseeing trip. Tourists. <laughs> I see. Well, it's been awfully nice chatting to you like this, but I must dash. Spot of exercising to do. A bit worried about my long adductors, actually. Yes, well, you would be. Uh, pip, pip, then. Ta-ta, then. Pip, as you say, sir. Pip. I oops a daisy eye. Hey, that looks like fun. It'll be quicker, too. Oh, no, sir, are you sure? Nonsense, is... Igor. Just watch this. <laughs> aye, aye, aye. Oops, a daisy. <laughs> uh, okay, all right. Now we're walking. Thirsty work exploring. What? Oh, oh, my word, my word, yes. Yeah. Well, what do you say we call a halt for a minute or two? Well, uh, I... Cup of tea. Oh, yes, good idea. Cup of tea. Cup of tea. That's a ticket, eh, Commodore? <laughs> That's the ticket, eh, Major? Did you know that if a flea were the same size as a man, it could clear St. Paul's Cathedral in a single bound? I wonder that, unappraised of that fact, I've been able to conduct my life at all up to now, my lord. Why? Why what, Nanny? Why does he want to jump over St. Paul's Cathedral? Oh, well, he, uh, no. Uh, well, it's hypothetical. Oh, sometimes you can be very cruel to your poor old Nanny. Why, what do you mean? Calling me pathetical. I mean, I may not be as bright no, as... No, Nanny. Hyper. Hypo. Hypo. Hypothetical. It's a... It's... <sighs> Come on, you two. We'll never get to the Lost Temple at this rate. Yes. Yes, persistent that hallucination. What? Uh, <laughs> yes, persistent. Um... <clears throat> I say, uh, Commodore... <laughs> What's that, Major? <clears throat> Speaking as an expert on these matters, would you say that... <clears throat> A hallucination could find a lost temple and its hidden hoard of untold wealth. Uh, highly improbable, Major. Highly improbable. Oh, good, good, good. Just as well, eh? <laughs> Aha, the waterfall. Left at the waterfall, he said. Come on, this way. Uh, please, sir. Just a moment, sir. Yes, Igor? <laughs> Could we rest for a moment, my lord? I have to admit to feeling a, a trifle weary. Oh, all right, Igor. You sit down here and have a little rest. I'll have a look at volume seven, five to four. Well, in that case, my lord, I'll get Nanny to put the kettle on. The kettle on? What are you talking about? Five to four, my lord. Time for tea. Igor, you're getting as bad as Nanny. Mm. Five to four. Uh, I shall sit down here and have a little rest. You do that, Igor. Excuse me, my lord. Mm. Those plants, my lord, they have a rather nasty look to them, sir. I fear they may be anthropophagous. Hmm? Man-eating plants, my lord. No, just me eating a broccoli sandwich. I... Nanny! Nanny, look out! What's the matter, Ducky Boos? Oh! 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 Put me down, you... Help! Oh! Oh! oh. oh. Right, Nanny, it's a man-eating plant. Huh? It's 
spitting off more than it could chew with you. If it's all the same to you, my lord, I'd rather have my rest near something that wasn't going to eat me. You want to push on, huh, Igor? As you say, sir. All right. Onwards to the last temple. Oh, uh, um, mm, mm, just the chap we were looking for. Yes, uh, we were wondering if you could put us right on a little query we have. Vs are Vs, hallucinations, jungle fever, etc., etc., etc. Uh, quite. Uh, and um, <clears throat> what it boils down to is um, is this. Are you chaps a hallucination? Look, what is all this hooey about a hallucination? I'm not a hallucination. Nanny, Igor, come here. These gentlemen seem to think I'm a hallucination. <laughs> Most entertaining notion, my lord. Well, I, I think that settles that little point. What? Come along? Yes. That all seems to be cleared up quite nicely. Yes. But the uh, the only only thing that remains to be clarified is um where you stand with regard to the undiscovered treasure of the uh of the uh I say okay, you did all right. Mm -hmm. Not looking one hundred percent tickety boo, but oh not him again. Uh. Well, this is a pleasant surprise. Found the lost temple yet, have you? Hmm? No, no. Uh, that is, uh, no, we're not even looking for it, are we? Aren't we? But I thought that's what Shh, all the... Shh, Nanny. <laughs> oh, she's a kidder. <laughs> Aren't you, Nanny? Yes. Yeah. Uh, no. <laughs> you got me all confused now, Master Dracula. I have to admit to a certain amount of confusion myself, sir. Uh... Oh. There. I say, I hope I'm not making a complete and utterly silly idiot of myself, but... Peter! Are you addressing me, sir? Good grief. It couldn't be. <laughs> Could it? Peter, it's me, Timmy. Oh, Timmy! Oh, my boy! Oh, 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 Major, my dear chap, allow me to present my long-lost son, Timothy. Oh, oh, Timmy, my good friend, the Major. Uh, I, I, I think, under the circumstances, um, you could call me Uncle Willoughby. Thank you, Uncle Willoughby. Timmy, my dear boy, <laughs> after all these years, Peter. Uncle Willoughby. Igor, Nanny, look! Over there! The quest is at an end! There is the lost temple of Barney! But you said we wasn't... Quiet, Nanny, mere subterfuge. Come on, we can sneak off before they notice we've gone. I hate to shatter your illusions, my lord, but... But me not, Igor. We're rich! Rich beyond our wildest dreams! But we're not at sea! Not at sea? No, we... What? So what's all this nonsense about submarines? Submarines, Nanny. Subterfuge. We're pretending. Oh, no, all right then. Pretending. Up, stethoscope. Prepare to launch to what you may call it. Nanny, please, not so loud. What are you doing? What you said. Pretending. I'm pretending I'm a submarine. Look, Nanny, I. Okay. Nanny, just make an emergency dive, will you, and try to keep quiet. Oh, I don't know. There's no pleasing some folk. You do your best to help on what you get. No thanks, that's what. No thanks, and I'll Sometimes, Sometimes I... I wonder why I... What are you going to do with your share, Igor? My share of what, my lord? The treasure, Igor. The loot, the mazuma, the filthy lucre, the spondulix, the mopus, the dough, the, 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 the... This temple seems strangely familiar. Yes, sir. Ooh, just like home. Just like home. It is! Yes, my lord. It would appear that we've been going round in a circle. No. Grown. My, my, my word, yes. Fine figure of a young man now, young Timothy. Peter, I wonder if you would spare an hour or two. There's a couple of rather jolly apes I'd like to meet. Jolly apes? Apes? Yes, Peter. They've been awfully good to me, really. I know they'd very much like to meet you. Oh, of course. Yes, any friend of yours is a friend of mine. <laughs> well, well, Timmy, if you insist. 
Uh, are you coming, Mesra? Uh, uh, as long as I won't be in the way. Not at all, Uncle Willoughby. Delighted to have you along. Good show. <laughs> Good show. <laughs> Good show. <laughs> Gas bad form, what? Yes, gas bad form, the chap lied to us. Hallucination all the time. Well, that's it. Never trust a hallucination, that's what I always say. Ah, I hate you, I hate you. Why couldn't you have been the lost temple? Why me? Why, why? And so, once more, we leave Castle Ducula as the evil count turns from fiend to foe. That's volume five. And I turn to you to say, good night out there, whatever you are. <laughs> <laughs> He's back.